Hey, this is Gib coming at you from Ripping the RC Life. Uh, we got a Hobby Plus CR18 uh, crawler, uh, I'm guessing trail truck. Um, just picked this up uh, the other day. I've got, uh, I guess, a, a few battery packs through it. Haven't really done much to it. Um, I'm dabbling in the crawling and and stuff, you know, the uh, trail trucks. Uh, these are, this is an 18 scale. I got an Axial 24, the, SX, the SCX 24. Um, that one turned out to be a blast. So I went out and picked this up at uh, at uh, San Antonio Hobby. It's, it's uh, Alamo's, Alamo Hobby. So I went out and picked this up at Alamo Hobby. Um, little 18 scale truck. I, I really picked it up for the aesthetics. Um, pretty cool little looking truck. I haven't done any mods to it. Definitely plan on it. Um, but we're out here at one of my favorite little hiking areas. And it's great for this size truck. Probably any size. Well, I mean, not any size, but you know, to even 10 scale out here wouldn't be that bad. Uh, of course, I don't have anything in that uh, zone yet, but uh, we're working on it, right? <laughs> um, but yeah, we're going to give this a little bit of runtime. Uh, Hobby Plus CR18. It does have a pretty good little system in there. It's not too bad. I haven't ran it too much. I got a little bit of runtime at the house. But I haven't figured out if this is more of a trail truck or a rock crawler. I'm guessing you can go either way with it. It's not that fast, but I think it is fast enough. But I don't know what type of battery life you're going to get out of it. So it is pretty bouncy. Definitely going to need some shocks for this thing. Some work on it. I do want to get uh, uh, some tires for it and whatnot. Uh, this is straight out of the box, so no, uh, no upgrades. But it does have a good, uh, I guess what you call a drag brake system in here. So that's always pretty cool. Um, the look is pretty realistic too. The 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 rack up top does accept lights. They got little uh, holes in the back, so that's a good thing. Ooh, this looks like it's going to be a chore for this truck, but we're going to give it a shot. Like I said, the drag brake's pretty good, and it does have, to me, maybe a. a a uh, low center of gravity is not too bad. Nice, made it. Um, what I do want to modify is going to be one of the first ones. It's going to be free. Is that bumper? Um, the bumper coming up on steep inclines, it does get hung up. Uh, and uh, in there though, if you reverse. The brace that the bumper goes onto, it'll pick up the brace a few millimeters. Uh, it'll pick up the bumper, should I say, a few millimeters. Well, the brace as well. The brace is curved a little off, so it's going to definitely pick that up. And that'll definitely give us... It'll definitely give us a little bit more clearance in the front. I mean, who knows? I might remove that bumper altogether. I think it looks pretty cool. There, there is a back bumper, but I'm seeing that it may cause the same issue here. Nice drag brake. Look at that. That's a pretty good motor in there. That is pretty good. I've been watching videos, kind of getting uh, tips and whatnot. Trying to see what I can pick up, what I may learn, what I may learn to do, what, what I may learn not to do.
It is just a bit bouncy though. That is uh, something that is, uh, I'm pretty sure, fixable with the right set of shocks. See, this looks like it's all rock. I think I want to take it back up. What do you think, guys? I think that's going to be a pretty decent climb for this truck. And here, it looks like just wash and rock. Maybe we'll... Let's go see around the corner real quick. Yeah, let's turn it around. And it's all about those lines, right? I'm getting hung up there. I definitely want to get some. Oh, that's nice right there. Yeah, that's. Oh, let's do it again, I guess, right? Yeah. Wasn't a fluke. It's quite a little bit noisy. Not terrible. Well, this thing might be a crawler after all. Oh, maybe we should go around that. That looks like a steep one. Nice. It handled it. Oh, first roll over. Not too bad. It is nice right there. That is pretty good. Find the line here because I think I got us in a bad spot here. We might be able to get out of here. And this is definitely not.
Nice. Good spot. See if we can use that branch as to our advantage so we don't roll over. I think we just did. Well, that was a good one right there. You gotta like the looks of this thing. It is a pretty cool looking truck. One more along the lines of old school looking vehicles. And retro is kind of not my style. Well, I don't know. Maybe it is retro. I guess it depends what year we're talking about. <laughs> So these uh, little trucks really surprised me, performance-wise. It uh, did pretty amazing on those downhill grades, even going up on dirt, um, making its way up, and uh, it's still still kicking up them that dirt, still kicking up them rocks. Should we go up it? See if we can find our way through this little trail here. If you can see the truck. There's going to be some rocks you get through here, so it's definitely going to need some
we can find some lions through here. One thing I forgot to mention is servo is pretty strong. This one's going to be very tricky. Yeah, I don't think it's going anywhere. I'm going to have to back it off. Oh, look at that. We got some good action coming up. We're gonna give this truck, uh, for sure, some test here. Definitely not gonna be too easy. Look at that. There we go. Nice. That was very nice. Oh, we got another sure one over here. Maybe not too hard, but it's at a good incline. Oh, bad. Lost it. Let's try that one again. Take it off more to the side here. Any loose gravel. Maybe we should stick to the rock. Oh, that was nice right there. A little bit of a struggle, but she got it. Yeah, with definitely with a little bit of upgrades, maybe just some tires and some shocks. But we can definitely make this a, a nice truck. Um, it's got a brush system in there. We'll test that for sure, see how long it lasts. And We'll go from there. That was our uh, little uh, Hobby Plus CR18 uh, Convoy, it says in the back. Um, there's a few different models in there. Um, the truck did great. 
it's uh it's a pretty good truck i think with some upgrades uh, some tires maybe some shocks this thing's gonna do do very good um this is gib cutting out from ripping the rc life channel y'all have a good one folks